Good morning, afternoon or evening. I just want to walk through the engagement ratings and the sort of visualisations you'll see and the student will also see when they log into stream and you look at an individual student. And we're using Madison Green here. And Madison Green is a test account that we use for the SQE uh, 1 and 2. Um, so as I look at Madison here, I, there's a number of things that we want to pick up on. Firstly, overall, we get things like the engagement rating, which in this, in this sense is over the last 14 days. However, if you look at it, I've got my dates here, um, my to and from dates I've picked earlier on in the uh, in, in last summer, as this is gives me the test data. So as I scroll down, I can see that I get a visualization as a, a sort of a timeline over that and I've picked this particular time period which shows me how her engagement rating has ebbed and flowed from, from high down to, to very low. Um, if I so wish in the same timeline I could include the cohort average so I can see that there's some dips there as well and that may be well to do with the curriculum design and I can also see if I so wish the top 25% uh, so um, you can do some comparisons within the cohort. As this engagement, uh, another key area I think is really interesting is if you look at this, um, what we call the sort of helicopter view for the time period down here. This gives you a sense of how that engagement rating has ebbed and flowed um, over the time period where you might be able to start to identify when you're having conversations with students, patterns, patterns emerging around some interactions or lack of interactions on say the end of the week or the start of the week or, or whatever. Um, so that gives you another visualisation of how the engagement has, ha has, has changed and ebbed and flow over time. So as I look around the screen again, the sort of things that we would um, be able to pick up on or important things which will be coming through will be information such as resources. So if you looked in the resources tab, this starts to identify things such as well, what contributes to the algorithm and um, how they've been interacting over that time period with information in the algorithm. When you also look on the profile, this pulls information from our student records, such as personal information, contact details, etc. Um, I get attendance and I also get the assessment tab. And the assessment tab pulls information currently from Unit E in terms of graded information in terms of final, uh, final assessments. So that gives you a little bit of an orientation to when you log in and you search for a student in the My Search Students area, or you click on a student through the My Dashboard. So for instance, in this particular place here, um, Jill might have gone in and this went and looked for Madison Green here, and then just clicked on Madison's details. That would develop out or would display the screen for you. Thank you.